good, isn't he? Isn't he good? Yeah. Really That's amazing. Good. Yeah, I know. Now, we, as I say, we've been gone out to Twitter. We've asked people to tweet questions. Mm. The audience also are going to put their questions to you. <laughs> Jonathan Griffiths is in the audience. Nice looking chap there. In, in, mm. in the, in the, there. What's, your, what's your question, Jonathan? Uh, yeah, um, Stephen, you're a very attractive man, uh, even to straight men. Oh. And I was just wondering whether there are any women that you find sexually attractive. Oh. It's a very good question, and uh, the answer is yes. Yes, I, I, I can... Call yourself a gay? <laughs> I've always, I've always called myself 90% gay. Oh. So <laughs> there will always be one in ten of, of the human race um, uh, who, who are female. So who, who, who does, it for, who does my... it for you, then? Well, there have been ones you wouldn't know in the past. Funny enough, I write <laughs> about Let's them Let's embarrass the them publicly, then. <laughs> well, one, she knows this, and her husband knows this, um, um, is when... We were talking about this earlier. When we were doing Blackadder 2, I found... My makeup artist, strangely alluring and yeah. likable. And I said to Hugh at the time, Do you know, I think I'm going to ask her out. And Hugh said, Wow, really? I said, Yeah, I think I am. And the next day, I was sort of sitting in the makeup chair. She used to glue on this big beard I had as Lord Melchett. And um, she said excitedly, I'm going to the races with, uh, with Rowan um, next week. I went, oh, oh, fine, no problem. <laughs> She's been married to him for 20 years. Aww. And uh, she, she always says, I would have gone if you'd asked me. I would have gone out with you. Aww. And Ron says, no, darling, you wouldn't. <laughs> he, he, he says, no, you would not. <laughs> no, matter of fact, you wouldn't. <laughs> um, <laughs> we had a, a Twitter question. This is Anna's 1229. Please ask Stephen... Is there anything he's not interested in? I think... I mean, in theory, not. I have to confess, and I don't mean this as a snobbish, bitter point, I'm, I'm really not interested in, in these kinds of things, these people that I've never heard of in celebrity magazines or these uh, X-Factory mm. things. I just don't watch them. I find the whole thing embarrassing. And embarrassment to me is an emotion that's really quite strong, like, like fear or anger... And I just go like that, and I, can't, I cannot watch it. Even on my own, I'm embarrassed. But if there's someone else in the room, I go, ah, ah it makes me slightly shudder if I see Piers Morgan talking uh, to, about something. I just, no, it's not, to, I'm not making a smart point about Piers Morgan. It's to say, or I just go, ah, ah, ah. What, what, what like... was it you said on, on Radio 4? Oh, the, go on, tell Well, there's that. this um, show that you and I have both done called uh, I'm Sorry I Haven't a Clue, which is a great old radio comedy show. And they have a round, and it's like a sort of mad quiz show. They call it the antidote to panel games. And, uh... You have to find an ordinary English word and give a, uh, an example, a new meaning for it. So, I mean, for example, I did one which was measles, which is what artists use for self-portraits. It's that kind of thing. And um, countryside, which is to kill Piers Morgan. Um, <laughs> Yeah. Right, we'll have um, one last question. We'll throw it open to the... Oh, oh it's, there we are. It's, it's Rosemary. What is your question for Stephen? Stephen, why have you not yet been knighted? <laughs> is that for both of us? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, far be it for me to answer. Um, it's a lot better to be asked why you haven't been knighted than to be asked why you have. <laughs> um, and uh, it's not for me to say. I'm very happy being myself. Um, are, you I, one, are you one of those people who, who would turn it down? I, I w if I did, I wouldn't crow about turning it down. Still can't be sure whether you have been offered or haven't it's been It's a private matter between me and my monarch. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Stephen Fry. Thank you, very much. Thank you Stephen. Thank you very much indeed. Thanks as well to the brilliant Daniel Schloss here to play us out with That's All. It's C16! Trapped like a rat I was caught Oh, that's a fact I pace Oh, this cell Four square foot Oh, hell I'm marked 
That's all. 